Hello, I am Karen Gray and thank you for stopping by my page today. On the 11th of December 2019, I was made redundant for the fourth time in my life at 61 from a job I'd had for 10 years. I knew that my age would be something against me getting um, a good career going forward. Um, so I knew I didn't have an awful lot of um, probably choices which was a kind of a frightening reality for me. Ideally, I didn't want to go back to work. Um, I knew about my redundancy, I knew it was coming up, and so the year before that, I tried to stay this up and make a nest egg, and I tried that. Um, in other words, I could retire rather than anything else. And I tried that by doing online trading, but it didn't work out, it was a disaster. And for the first time in my life, I found that I got myself into debt. Um, I was being made redundant. I was in a really bad place. And I felt too ashamed to even share that with anybody. So I had to come up with a solution, which I did. I took out a loan and put the majority of, of what I owed onto that. And then took put the rest over onto interest-free credit cards. But what that meant is that I had to work, have to continue to work um, for another five years until I'm 66. So um, one day I left work on the 19th, the next day I was in um, being interviewed with temporary agencies, but because it was close to Christmas, there was no jobs until the end of January, and I secured a job with a government department. Um, which was fine, it meant I was working more hours though, I was having to use public transport which I hadn't had to before and I was being slightly paid slightly less. So not as good as it was but it was it was still a job and that was fine. Then COVID-19 came along and I was lucky because within four weeks of lockdown I was given a computer and told to work at home and it's that that's made everything change. Because what I found is I liked working from home. I never thought I would do. Um, I had a much better work-life balance, even though I had to sit in front of the computer for seven and a half hours a day. But it enabled me to go and sit in my beautiful garden at lunchtime and chill out and look at the flowers and the insects. And I just found that it's something I wanted to do now. I don't want to go back into an office ever again. I don't want to have to do the commute ever again. But I want more freedom. I don't want to have to sit seven and a half hours in front of the computer again. I want more control over my life. So I want to be able to go out on coffee dates with my husband when I want to and go out on treasure trails with my daughter and my sister when I want to and not have to book holidays around everybody else and try and fit in. Life's too short for that. So I looked for a solution on the internet and what I found was a proven and tested roadmap of how to build an online business from scratch around the current working hours that I do but at the same time join a wonderfully supportive community um, of experienced entrepreneurs and new entrepreneurs that actually have my back. I didn't even know such a thing existed. Um, I was amazed at the training and support I've received and in fact I've just launched my first website, which I would never ever have been able to do on my own. I'm just so excited about that. So if you're in a similar position, if you're looking for a better way out of redundancy or you're looking uh, to do something instead of retirement or you want to get away from the nine to five, the, the job, the commute, um, the being working around for somebody else, then all I suggest is that you take a look at this. There's a link below, just uh, click on that. It's free for video, so it's completely risk-free for you. And just check it out and see if it's something that you you know, you know, want to do or fit in your life. I'm, I'm no longer afraid of the future. I know that come next year, my debt will be paid and that I can look forward to a fantastic retirement, um, doing the things I want to, uh, living my life on my own terms and I don't think I do anything better than that. So thanks again for popping by. Click on the link below and tell me what you think. Thanks, bye. Mm -hmm.